Hey yo guys, so this is our new camera. Say hello to the camera. This is where I wanna be, nah, nah, nah. Never ever gonna leave, nah, nah, nah. You ain't no unit for me, nah, 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 Good morning, guys. So this is Raja. He is the newest member of the Perkins family. He's so cute. I just love him. You are so beautiful. He's just purring away in my ear. So I picked him up a couple of days ago and he's still getting used to us. He's still getting used to the house. He's uh, running around crazy at the moment playing. He has these little uh, bursts of energy. He's eight months old. He's a Bengal cat. This is his tunnel. Ah, and he's off. Where are you going? <laughs> so we're about to go to the eye doctor because Zoe has been saying that her vision is blurry sometimes and she's been telling me that she needs glasses. Today we're going to go and get it checked out. Zoe's really excited because she wants glasses. So we'll see what happens. We'll see if she needs them or not. Try on these, this one. The blue ones. Oh, you're cute. <laughs> what do you think of those? They're too classic. <laughs> Where do you even come up with this stuff? <laughs> too classic. Those ones are cute. Too pink. Too pink. <laughs> you are very particular. I think I like these You like those ones the best? Yeah. I have to take care of them because my eyes will get so sore. You want in the heart shape. And then what shape is this one? House. What about this shape? So Zoe just had some drops put in her eyes because some of the tests that they were doing was showing that she may possibly be short-sighted but to make sure they had to put these drops in her eyes and leave them in for an hour so we just come down at McDonald's and then we're going to go back in an hour and see what the optometrist says see how these drops affect her eyes I don't 100% understand how they work all I know is um, she's going to be able to figure out if she needs glasses or not. So today I wanted to talk to you guys about something that's been on my mind lately, but it's something that's uncomfortable to even think about, and that's life insurance. To me, family is everything, and I just love being the type of dad that's always there for the important stuff. But the reality is I know that tomorrow isn't promised. Every day that we're alive is a blessing, and that's really scary and uncomfortable to think about. But as parents, I feel like it's our job to think about the uncomfortable stuff. It's our job to plan for the future. And I wanna know that if God forbid something should ever happen to me, that I'm still able to provide for my children. So with this in mind, I wanted to tell you guys about a company called Ethos, who's also today's sponsor. With them, I found out that getting life insurance is so much easier than I had expected because traditionally I'd heard that it can be really confusing and time consuming, but with them, it's as simple as filling out a survey online. You don't even need to go to the doctors and get blood tests and do all that stuff. All you need to do is answer some medical questions honestly, and within 10 minutes, they can give you a quote. It's as easy as that. So it's pretty good to know that for as little as $10 a month, you can have that sort of peace of mind. Also, random fact, because you guys know I love my random facts, I read on Investopedia that the average life insurance plan can go up between eight and 10% per year. But when you sign up with Ethos, you can actually lock in a fixed rate for the term of your plan. Also, another random fact, according to the Life Insurance Marketing and Research Association, 40% of people who have life insurance wished that they had gotten it at a younger age. Obviously, you're gonna be saving money if you're getting that fixed lower rate. So for all my US-based subscribers, if you'd like to know more about Ethos and get an easy online quote, 
Check the link that's in my description box below. Let me know how you go and let's get back to the vlog. Let's look at the TVs and see what you can see. So it turns out Zoe's got a slight stigmatism in her left eye, but it's very, very slight. And she said it's not enough to warrant needing glasses. It's something we can keep an eye on in the future. But Zoe was really excited about getting glasses. So she's a bit upset. You really wanted glasses, didn't you, Bubba? Maybe when you're a bit older, you might need them, okay? But now we can just wear sunglasses. They're still fun. Mm, you did so well though. You're such a good girl. I'm very proud of you. So I just picked Ava up from school and she's like, Dad, can I tell everybody on my vlog about our cat? So here it is, the cheeky Ava and Zoe channel. He actually likes me. Dad, look, he's in my lap. Mm, oh, you you want to go? You want to go? Okay, baby. Dad. I, I don't believe it. It's my first time it, of him in my lap. And Why is he right. so heavy? He's really heavy, isn't he's he? He's so heavy. I feel like he might even get a little bit bigger because he's eight months old. Yeah, because, so. it was, because when I was picking him up and putting him on my lap to show you guys, he was like so heavy. Mm. He's so heavy, that cat. He is. Is this his little mouse toy? It is his little mouse toy. And I um I got him some cat treats before. He loved these. What are they called? They're called churu bites. I don't even know what's in them, but I asked the lady at the pet shop what is like candy for cats. And it literally looks like little candy bites, and he went crazy for them when um, also, I need to organize my pantry. It is Daddy, such a mess. Have this? Yes, you can. Thanks for asking so nicely. Daddy, I forgot I wanted those ones. Well, you already opened a packet of the other chips, so you're going to have to eat them. Yeah. You're so fat. <laughs> that is you. That's your own reflection. <laughs> he's, look, he's looking for the cat in the mirror. <laughs> That's you, Raja. <laughs> Hey, good morning, Raja. Good morning. I can hear him saying good morning back. He okay. can? On this. Whoa! Dad. He's good at jumping, isn't he? Yeah, and Dad. Yeah. I, I, I heard him say good, good morning back. You did? Okay, I can you could understand that. animals. Mm -hmm. You must have got that from Grandpa. I'm convinced that your Grandpa can understand animals too. That's why they all love him so much. Last night, I put this cat playhouse together for Raja and he is just absolutely loving life in it, aren't you, Raja? He knew straight away that it was for him because it was like half built and he was already jumping on it. Although I will say it was a little bit of a, this is what I ordered versus this is what I got situation. It was a bit cheaper than I expected. And when I got it, like all this stuff, as you can see, the, the fluff just comes off it. It made such a mess putting it together. And I feel like he is gonna trash it because it's meant for scratching and he does scratch on it. I feel like, this isn't gonna last long. And even these little beds, they're, it's just like fabric around this. I thought this was all solid. And then it's got a screw that I need to put like a cushion in there or something like that. Cause the screw pops out. But all in all, he really loves it. There's a lot of stuff for him to do. And he loves playing on it. And last night he literally just 
sat up here for like three hours asleep. He did not want to get off it. Did you, buddy? No. So I'm trying something new with Zoe's hair today. I'm going to try using a curly gel from Curly Kids in it while it's like it's out. Normally I only use gels when I slick her hair back. Normally when her hair's out, I'll use mousse or I'll use oil um, or just like curl defining products. I've never actually tried gel. I've always thought it would just weigh it down a little bit too much. But I saw this video on Instagram today and the curl definition that this person got was just so good. I was like, you know what? I'm gonna give it a try today. We'll see how it goes. My hair's finished. Raj is still over here. <laughs> and she looks so cute. It didn't turn out exactly like it did in the tutorial that I watched, but she looks so cute. It's a constant learning journey. Anyway, I need to do some boring dad stuff. I need to do the laundry, which is something that I'm just always putting off. And now I've got a mountain of clothes to get through. I'm so sad. Look at my beautiful blue leather chair. Look at these scratch marks. These are from Raja. So what he does is he sits on this and then he jumps to this chair and when he lands, he does all of this. This chair was not cheap either. I'm gonna have to figure out how to stop him from going on my leather chairs. My couch has some scratch marks as well. I gotta figure this out. <laughs> I didn't think I didn't think it would be such an issue and I'm giving him all this stuff to scratch. I'm giving you all this stuff to scratch. I still love you. We gotta figure this out. We have to figure this out. <laughs> I jumped on Google and apparently you can get this spray that you spray on your furniture to deter cats from getting on it. I don't know if it's gonna work or not, but we just came down to the pet shop to look for some. Hopefully it doesn't deter us as well. Hopefully it doesn't smell too bad, but um, yeah. My leather furniture was quite expensive and can't afford to replace it, so. Gotta try and figure this out. Also, as the day has gone on, Zoe's hair is looking so cool. Now that it's all dry. You know your hair looks really beautiful, Zoe? Mm -hmm. Do you like it like this? Mm -hmm. Give Hello. it a... All right. Well, it gets into my way a lot. It gets in your way a lot, in your eyes. So Ava actually has her school dance tonight. Can you believe it guys? Ava has her first school dance. When I was a kid, you didn't go to school dances in grade one, but now they have school dances for the whole school. Uh, she's going straight after school. And Zoe is a little bit sad that she can't go. I was actually supposed to take her to gymnastics tonight, but I decided as a special treat, we're gonna go to a play center instead, just to cheer her up. And when we go to school, I'm gonna go just a little bit early so I could have a little sneaky peek because I, I wanna see the school dance. Parents technically aren't allowed to go unless they're like the chaperones. I'm not chaperoning tonight. But yeah, Ava is really excited about it. <laughs> Big hug. Yeah. 
Yeah. You got it? <laughs> uh oh, there's crocodiles in that water. We're gonna have to get over here somehow. Jump on. Ready, set, go! Yeah. Uh oh, he's coming back. I thought we were gonna try and get away from the crocodiles. He came back. All right, ready, steady. I'm, I'm stuck. I got crocodiles here. I got crocodiles there. I'm literally stuck in the middle of the crocodile river. Um, I got Zoe pulling me. Oh, 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 okay. Thanks, Zoe. You saved my life. Okay. There you go. Zoe, you saved my life. I'm, I'm struggling to keep up with her these days. Ever since I had the you know what, I'm just, I'm feeling a lot better, but I'm, I'm struggling to get my energy back. So I could not be bothered making, I just didn't have the energy to make dinner tonight. So don't, don't judge me, we're at McDonald's again. That's two Happy Meals in three days. I feel like a terrible parent right now, but um, how's your Happy Meal? So I got this stuff, it's called Nature's Miracle, just for cats. Scratching deterrent spray. You're supposed to put a little bit of this wherever they're scratching. Fingers crossed it works. <laughs> Zoe's over there pretending to be a cat. <laughs> about to go and pick Ava up from her school dance. I went and changed, I don't know, am I weird? I didn't want to show up to my daughter's first school dance dressed like a teddy bear with uh, ripped tracksuit pants. So I went and put on some half decent clothes and I know it's just picking her up from a dance. I mean, I look dressed up. I literally just went, took my old clothes off and put a jumper, a jacket and a scarf on because it's cold. But to me, it's a really big deal. <laughs> it's her first dance. Um, it just makes me feel like my daughter's growing up. It's a special moment. I probably overthink everything. I'm overly sentimental. But these little moments, I overthink. I didn't want to be dressed like a teddy bear. Just, just looking bummy, picking my daughter up from her first school dance. So I had to look half decent. Am I weird? You guys will let me know, I'm sure. I, I just, I, I feel... Yeah, like she's growing up. It's silly. I don't know, I'm weird. Anyway, I'm gonna go pick her up. I can't wait to hear all about it. And uh, Raja, you be good, okay? No more scratching the couch. You just scratch this thing. Oh, you're a good boy. You're actually such a sweet cat. Also clipped his nails before as well, and he was so good. He just sat there patiently and let me do it. So Ava just got home from her first dance. How was it? Good. What'd you do? Um, dance, of course. <laughs> of course. And the next thing that I did was dance. And, and dance. Thing, and the next thing that I did was dance. And you had a DJ as well, and right? And the next thing I did was go and get free water for my school. Mm-hmm. The water was free and then they got popcorn as well. Mm-hmm. But something that surprised me was they didn't even play musical statues. How could you have a school dance, a kid's school dance, without musical statues? Not a thing. That foundation thing. Oh, what? Oh, you're too... Uh, you're, thing. Too, you're too old for musical statues now? Yeah, not my thing. Me and Zoe were playing musical statues while we were waiting to go. Ah, ah, the worst children's game! Why do you want to be an adult so much? What do you think the best thing about being an adult is? I can have as much sugar as I want. That's true, but it's also not true because you might get diabetes. Did you know when you're old, if you eat too much sugar, you can actually get sick? You, you always get more, more lollies. Like, you always get more lollies than me. Anyway, on that note, guys, I will see you in the next vlog. She's kind of got me on that one. Bye. Bye.
Bye. But wait, 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 wait. Ooh. Wait, guys. Link I below if you want to see me scared, Dad. If if you guys can give this vlog um like 100 things, we are going to do a vlog where where me and Zoo keep scary Dad. So click, get clicking. Well, we can scare Dad. I th I think we're gonna need more than a hundred likes to to do to do that. Yeah. We can. Yeah, I don't want this vlog to happen. I'm not trying to get scared all day. I'll tell you what, if we reach 4,000 likes, you can do your scary vlog. All right, guys, 4,000 likes and Ava takes over the vlog for the day and they uh, try to scare me.